Well, I've lived in the neighborhood for 71 years. Actually, I lived in the same house for 71 years. It was first owned by my grandmother, then my father bought it from her, then I bought it from my father. So I'm a pretty long time resident of the hill. You know, I can still remember my buddies standing outside hollering it up at the windows for us. And then we'd all get together and start picking everybody else up as we went along going down to Farnham. Where we were and what we've become is just unbelievable. To me, a lot has changed in the last couple of years since Zoe's come into the picture. In the very beginning, after we formed our organization, we held a humongous town hall in St. Joe's Hall over there and we invited all SOE residents to come and to listen to what we had to say and to tell us what they'd like to see. So from there, we took that information. We, now we had something to act on. We have a lot of programs now, rent to own and uh, assistance for buying houses. It's things that we didn't have before as a small group that we now have access to. We have the home repair program. Things actually get done. We have the money to act on things. Safety committee, we've, we're, we supply porch lights to the residents free of charge. We have rental houses that are not to be sold. They're not to be flipped and sold. We wanna hear new ideas. We wanna know what we can do to make you feel comfortable in the neighborhood. You know, what, what are your concerns? I'm not special. Anybody can be silly. Anybody can join, you know. We welcome people to come. We, we have our board meetings. We have an open board meeting that for the first few minutes, people in the audience can ask questions or they can ask follow-up questions on something the board has discussed and stuff. We, we invite involvement. So that, that's what's really important to us, getting new faces, new people that are interested in it, and people that want to continue to see the improvements that we've already started to make.